Well, grab your crayons and notebook paper. It is back to school time for Central Illinois. For some, it's their first time in school, and for others, their first time in the United States. That's right. We're talking about exchange students. Have you guys ever studied abroad? No. Have you ever had an exchange Arkansas, student? Arkansas. Is that studying abroad? <laughs> Close? Might as well be for right <laughs> for Central Illinois. That's Might pretty well. foreign. Sometimes, right? <laughs> well, we I had a I had a German exchange student. You no did. Benny. Benny. Yeah, when I was young. Anyway, um, <laughs> IUSA is an exchange program for high school students. It's an opportunity to learn English and our culture. But I learned from hosts in St. Joe, it can even create a family bond. You can move to my room. She's cute. Oh. Yeah, then <laughs> did you say I, I can't? Can. No. Yeah, I say you can't. This conversation isn't uncommon when an older sibling is moving out. But these aren't siblings. They're exchange students. My daughter and I were in Girl Scouting, and we just received an email from the home office that uh, AUSA was looking for host families, and Max and I talked it over, and we just have one child and thought that would be a good experience for her to have a sibling. That was nine years ago. Their first student was Beatrice from Italy. When you grow up in Europe, you have the stereotype of the America, and I'm sure that the Americans have the stereotype of Europe. So um, I just wanted like, you know, to have this kind of experience and uh, to learn better English because it's really like different when you study a language like uh, in, in the school. We had Beatrice for the four months and then we didn't do it again for a number of years because we didn't, we were afraid to jinx our experience because it was so perfect the first time. But eventually Eve from Finland stayed for a year and now Lucas from Chile. Well, it must be nice, you have a, now you have another guy. Though. So we have a guy yeah. now, now he can do uh, housework or Oh yeah, sure, I can be the nanny. <laughs> you don't have a nanny here. <laughs> you can be a nanny now. <laughs> they say, hey mom, I'm gonna go for, I, I wanna go for a student exchange. Can you pay it? And then they start like moving all the pieces to made that this happen. I was kind of scary too because it was the first time I left my house and my mom and my brother and sister. So I just say, okay, I'm just going to be to stay there like four months. And I that's it's like I regret that so much because I really like um, wanted to stay more. When like the experience was almost to finish, I was like, oh my god, I don't want to leave because it was really a great time. Well, the high school. I think it's it's like <laughs> in the movies. It's like the same, Is it? and the people here and they're so nice. From the high school side, we can talk about the homecoming. That was like one when if you are a girl and you want to come to the state, that's the main thing you think about like high school. Oh my God, I want to go to the homecoming because we don't have that in Europe. So for me, it was like kind of oh my God, I'm I feel like I'm in a movie or something. And so I remember that like I start like uh, going shopping with Debbie's mom uh, to find my dress, and then it was everything so new for me. You know all the pictures and like uh, I had uh, like my friend just went to me so he was my date. That was uh, well, how you see it in the movies. So I remember like uh, showing my friends when I went back to Italy in my picture and everything and that it's one of the best memories I have from high school here. I have a lot of best memory but from high school that was the best one. You learn a lot about yourself as a family. Uh, for us, I mean maybe you don't think you have only love for your own kids, but there's really a lot more. It just adds a whole new family dynamic, and we just really like it. I really like them. It's like, it's better than I thought that it'll be. Like, so similar to mine, and we're like always joking and all the stuff, and they care about you, you know, so it's good. When I came here first, I was like, it's gonna be nice, I'm gonna meet new people, but you never like expect like to um, get like, uh, to receive and be able to give so much love from people you don't know. We really, uh, me and Debbie and Max and Emily, I feel I'm part of the family. Hearing Beatrice say these kinds of things, I mean, about about how you are her, her second family now. Yeah. I mean, what, what's that like? That must be awesome. Uh, well, it almost made me cry, actually. 
Yeah, but I mean, it's true, it's how we feel. Everybody chooses the way that fits them the best to help. You know, some people ha give their time, some people give their money, everybody has their cause. Uh, and this is just the way that Max and I chose uh, to do our little part to help make it better for someone else. I'm glad to be here. No, I'm, I'm seriously, <laughs> I'm glad to be here. <laughs> so that is, that's crazy because I was telling you guys, I mean, Lucas, when I went and did that interview, he had only been there for two weeks. Wow. And Beatrice was just back visiting. She obviously did the exchange program years ago. Mm -hmm. And the dynamic was very much like, a family. It was like my family, uh, you know, at holidays and stuff. Yeah. So it was very That's interesting. Neat. Only two weeks that they've created that family environment. Yeah, yeah tight and, bond. Yes. And to be clear, it's not a requirement to be a supermodel to be an exchange student. <laughs> Right. <laughs> well, I don't know if they're going to be doing any voguing on, with their exchange students. Right. I, I have Super no mom. comment on that. But yes. Okay. Throw that out. Very then. good. We'll be right back. <laughs>